G'day folks, Corey Hind. I hope you're doing really well. So this is a short video, but it's important because I talk about these issues with people about Google Business Profile and their competition who might be breaking the rules or have something wrong. So what we're trying to do here is show you how to uh, report or edit somebody's listing on Google Business Profile. The reason this came up for me today was I was talking to somebody and we're discussing a competitor who may or may not have had their name right on Google Business Profile. Now, that can be an unfair advantage. So what we assume happens is Google just figures it out and these people get suspended. But really what happens is, for the most part, we need to report that ourselves to keep it as a level playing field. So I'll show you on here what you do. Now, this is my area. Let's say, for example, that mixed signals down here is the competitor that's got the wrong name. Now, he has the right name. I know Bevan, he's a great guy. I'm just using this as an example. But let's say you're around the corner and, and his listing was called Mixed Signals, the best blah, blah, blah in Tauranga. What you would do is click on there. So you'll see that it comes up with his name on the map. You just click on the map right there. And over on the left-hand side, you'll see his details come up. We're just waiting for that now. Just try it again. And there it is. Sorry for that delay. So if you look at the listing there, it's it's okay, it's cool, and I really like this guy. It's a great business. I've used them myself. But if you were to want to edit or report, I use those interchangeably because people think it's this dob on report system. Really, it's just suggesting to Google that this isn't right. You should edit this. So you simply roll down the screen. And you'll just see here, suggest and edit. So once you've found them on the maps, you've clicked on it, they've appeared over here. You click on suggest and edit, and you'll see another box that comes up in the middle. And that will ask you to clarify exactly what it is you want to do. So suggest and edit, change name or other details, close or remove. Now, if a business was closed or had moved or something, you could do that. But here's what you do. You press that change name or other details button and it'll walk you through the process so that a Google person can review that and see if they've got it right or wrong. And what that does is it'll take away the unfair advantage they've gained by including um, a keyword in their name that's not their actual business name. And it's important we do this because we all want to keep Google fair and that's Google's goal is to give people the best results at all times. So that's how you do it. Hopefully you don't have to do it, but if you do have to do it, that's how you do it. All right, guys, thanks for your time. We'll talk soon. More videos coming. Make sure you subscribe. Bye.